Today I got a class. I'm reviewing a simple AC adapter. This is actually a 24 volt 5 amp uh, power supply. This is a switching power supply. And you would think this would not be that special of an item, but if you have ever shopped for a 24 volt power supply, especially for a uh, Zebra brand printer, you know that they're kind of pricey and kind of hard to find. What you need is something above 4.17 amps, and a lot of the ones that are rated for 4 or 5 amps are actually on the low side. I have tested a number of 4 and 5 amp power supplies in the 24 voltage range, and a lot of them fall short. So as you can see here, I've done a, a series of, of test pages. All of the other power supplies that I have tested couldn't even print one test page, and I, I just did 10 here to show you that this is a true 24 volt 5 amp power supply and it will power a Zebra printer which somehow happens to be the most power hungry device I have ever owned. Most things uh, they say they need a certain amount of power they actually draw a lot less. This, These Zebra printers use every bit of power that their power supply can supply. So um, in order to make it work I did have to use a uh, an adapter here. I used an adapter from one of my universal power supplies which I have also tested with, with the Zebra printer and it did not work. And uh, if you're curious and you're planning on using this with a Zebra power supply, you're looking at for a 6.2 millimeter tip, 0.245 inch tip, and the inside pin is 0.1195 or 3 millimeters. So you're looking for a 3 by 6.24 adapter, um, but this power supply will power your Zebra printers. Um, it'll power, if it'll power a Zebra printer, it'll power your LED light strips, um, anything in the 24 volt range up to 5 amps. Um, this thing will do it. If it can power the Zebra printer, it can pretty much do anything because the Zebra printer is the most power hungry thing I own, and I own a lot of devices. So, I'm going to go ahead and recommend this device. Uh, if you're using it for LED light strips or security cameras, it's got the the standard uh, LED light strip pin on it. Um, if you're powering something else, you're going to have to get an adapter. But the power is there and it will do what you want and the price is right. If you found this review helpful, make sure you hit yes. And if you're watching on YouTube, hit the thumbs up button and subscribe to the channel.